<laughs> Let's see, 120. That's a 16 inch. Let me get that 14 inch. Look at this. Yeah, I've seen a video of that next. That's a 12. It said 14 inch. That's a 14 inches, but it's a number 12. Uh, oh, that's a, that's more than this is like a cake and mold? this is a, can you turn this one over for me and see the brand on it made in the usa is what it says yeah yeah we, we get some light on it there you go oh yeah i see it there i had light on it this is eerie 125. you can bowl up anything can't you I like to have a smaller one of them that really works. Thanks, huge. That's on the wind sale, guys. <laughs> Sundial, yep. Fountain syrup. Oh, yeah. Five dollars. I want to buy it because it's cool. Five dollars? Yep. Yeah. Amber lightning fruit jar. They pretty. Yeah, they are. You don't see a whole lot of them around. No, nah, they're getting scarce. A lot of collections. There's something you like. There's got to be something you like. He likes Harley Davidson. You got that camera on? Yes, sir. You owe me some money. How much you need? I need like six hundred dollars. Is that all? Man, camera. everybody else wants like six thousand. No, I'm cheap. I'm, I'm you cheap. are. And I'll even split it with you, so you oh, give me. Man, credit. you a good man for doing that. I'm gonna charge you off the wheeling dealing on my space, okay? Well, I got. Damn, we gonna be so. broke before we even leave. Not even buy nothing. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty cool. Now I don't know who made that thing. They used the old nut. The square nut's pretty old. There used to be a couple of good hatchets there. I've sold about four or five. Yeah, morning. that's got a good look to it, just the shape of it. How much are they? I'd take five bucks for that one you had. Man, money. five bucks. You're trying to talk me into buying it. I weren't going to buy I'd, nothing. I'd bring stuff out here to sell. Yeah. 25 or something like okay. that. There. Thank you. All right. I thought they quit making ones. I ain't seen any today. Boy, that is a good sounding bell right there. Brass. Look at Angel, look at Angel on the front. What's it say right there on it? That's Latin. And how much are the larger bells? That's the 
Meet you. I appreciate you yes, watching. Sir. Nice meeting you too. He talks about you all the time. He watches that. Oh, look at this. Uh, yes. We were figuring next. I'm going to buy it and put it in my yard. Yeah, it's pretty. You're going to put flowers in it. What kind of double barrels are those? Uh, the one in the back is an American Gun Company gun. This one's a Belgian made. What's the price on those? That one's 400. The one in the back's 250. It needs a hammer replaced on it. Pretty and cool. A new firing. Pin. Oh, I've used fresh veggies. Look delicious. Do you want them? Yeah. What you getting on the vices? 350 each. They cool. <laughs> Is that kind of a heater? You went in a heater or something? Yeah, that was a uh, stove front. Man, that's cool right there. Yeah, it's cool. It's called the Apostle set. Nice on the on the front side. On the back side, it's got the normal cast iron look to it. Oh, yeah. yeah. yeah that's probably what I was using. Man, that's pretty. I've never seen one. You yeah. said it's called what? It's called the Apostle set. It's written. Apostle it's set. embossed oh. on the back there. And how much is this? I got a, uh, I do uh, 150 on it. That don't sound too bad. It's cool. Mm. I like unusual. That's unusual. That is. What is that? That's a 1920s whistle soda sign. Uh, I thought it was soda, I was yeah. for sure. Yeah, and so in the cool. 20s that they would take their six ounce bottle like this uh -huh. and it would sit in there and it would mount to the wall like so. How much is it? 2500 2500 Never seen one. Yeah, they, they're rare. They come up in auction every once in a while, but they're pretty rare. How about your Colonel Sanders? I got 300 on that. That's the early one. Thank That's you, sir. Yeah. Okay. It came out with another one. Marley? Yeah, don't get close to it. Video is five dollars a minute. Five dollars a minute. Yeah. Give me a hundred minutes. Okay. And All right. Emily goes. You on YouTube or what? Yeah. All right. Georgia bottle picker. Oh, Georgia. Okay.
<laughs> Who made it? French Klingon. Doesn't go inside. 19, uh, 1890. How much? Uh, 345. 
Is yours? What's the most expensive one here? I want to look at it. What's that? The most expensive gun. Uh, well, is that the one you want to buy? I want to look at it. Well, the most expensive one that I got is. Uh, yeah, that's German. <laughs> yeah, I've got the German. A long gun, here. not it's the a, pistol. It's a it's a long gun. It's a 16 gauge with a. Uh, over here. Underneath. That's this one right here. Oh, that one right there is the most expensive one. That's a German. Uh, it takes three thousand to buy it. All right. Can I? I just want to. Can I look at the uh, name of it there? Sure. I'm gonna leave my dog right here. It's, it? it's on this side right here on the barrel. You know, I got to thinking. That's not the old trigger. It's that set trigger. Because you got the selector. That's a set trigger. And what's the next one? That's a pretty gun. That's, That's awesome right there. That's a German. Uh, this one here is 1500 That's two beautiful, too. I actually had two on it, but I'll take it. It don't have any stainless. And then it's a what? That's 30, Winchester 3030. 30, that's what I thought of, 3030. Beautiful. Uh, then I got a little browning over here that's uh, 1500 Oh man, yeah, that's awesome. 22. 22. Do you have any 22 Magnums? No, I don't have a 22 Magnum. Those things are hard to find anymore. Man, what size is that one? 14. 14. Commend the boy. 
to pick it up. I bet. And I'm the boy. That's for big family. Well, that was part two of the Webster flea market. It was a fun flea market. I didn't buy a whole lot of stuff. I had four bottles in the last video and I got four items right here behind me we fit to take a closer look at. But it was fun. I'll go back to Webster. It's been a long time since I've been down there. I forgot how big it was. It was a big flea market. But I hope you enjoyed the video. Let's take a closer look. That's the items. That's the other four items that I bought down at Webster. I bought this little broad axe hatchet. I put it five dollars. I couldn't hardly pass it up. It don't have a name on it, but it's still worth about twenty-five dollars. The handle's in good condition, and the axe is in good condition. That shape right there, this little broad axe. You see, it's one-sided there. Twenty-five or thirty dollars. I bought this helmet. This is a Vietnam era helmet. I've sold a lot of these helmets over the years. And I saw a couple more down there. They wanted $40 for it. This guy wanted $40, but he come down to $35. And I bought it. I'll get about between $70 or $90. I just got around $85, $90 for the last two I sold. And then I had this, got this Coca-Cola fountain syrup carton for $5. It is faded. It's got some fading on it. But I'll still get $25 or so for that. I've sold those in the past also. And I got this Ball Perfect Mason Amber jar. This is a half gallon jar. I've sold a bunch of these over the years. He wanted 30, he come down to 25. And these actually come out of thermoses, metal thermoses, and these was down in them. You tear the thermos apart, you can get these amber jars out of them. And they worked about 55, $60. I always list them for $59.99 or best offer or $64.99 or best offer. But that was the stuff that I bought. Weren't a whole lot of stuff, but the flea market was fun. I love going to flea markets and looking around. I hope you enjoyed the videos. Do me a favor. Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment down below. Share the videos with your friends, with other people who you think will like these antique style videos. I'll see you in the next one.